the Minister of State for Petroleum Resources, Timmy Pre Silva, has inaugurated the 8,400 metric tons capacity liquefied petroleum gas terminal built by Techno Oil in Kirikiri, Lagos. Silva, who was represented by Dr. Musa Zaki, Deputy Director, Department of Petroleum Resources, commended the company on its great milestone and effort towards deepening LPG consumption in the country. Techno Oil has been consistent and powerful force in transforming the landscape of energy supply to the country and has been compliant with all our, 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 our set out regulations and guidelines. So we are happy to say that throughout the four year period that this project is being conceived, fabricated, and today that is being commissioned, every little approval Able required approval and permits have been sought and obtained by Techno Oil. You are requested the Minister of Petroleum Resources for us to resuscitate the botanization plants in order to deepen the LPG utilization. That has been heard and also to carry awareness. He said the Minister had put policies in place to boost the availability of natural gas resources in the country. So deliberate policies are put in place by the Honorable Minister of State for Petroleum Resources. There is National Gas Expansion Program. There is National Gas Flare Commercialization Program. And many other programs. Network code has been launched by the Minister. All with a single aim of making the gas resources available in Nigeria. And this will boost the rapid industrialization of the country and it will create a lot of jobs. If just this plant is going to provide about 2,000 jobs, you imagine if we have other opportunities across the value chain, how many jobs will be created? Developments such as this can only help to promote and deepen domestic LPG utilization across the state, reducing the state's carbon footprint and ultimately benefiting the people of Lagos State and Nigeria as a whole. Indeed, in establishing this 8,400 ton capacity LPG storage terminal in Lagos, Techno Oil has made a strategic investment, a significant step that will accelerate and deepen the growth of LPG to help diversify the economy, grow revenue, and more importantly, create jobs. The group managing director, Techno Oil, Mrs. Nkechi Obi, appealed to the federal government to come to the rescue of Nigerian industrialists in their bid to contribute to the economic growth of the nation. We remain thankful to the Lagos State Government for being a worthy host by providing a much appreciated conducive environment for our business to strive. We however plead with the Federal Government to come to the rescue of Nigerian industrialists in our bid to contribute to the economic growth of our nation. We plead with government to provide funding to industrialists in building key facilities such as this one. Government should consider reactivating its botanization plants and also building new ones across the country to, see, to guarantee LPG availability nationwide. According to her, the newly inaugurated terminal is expected to generate up to 2,000 jobs in the months ahead. We have commissioned the largest and safest LPG terminal, such a way that, of course, everybody knows that uh, there is an inadequacy of LPG storage in Nigeria, and uh, what we have done is to bridge the gap. What we have done, our model in techno oil is to look at gaps, look at gaps and cover it up, see what we can do, and the kind of complement government efforts in trying to provide infrastructure that will aid economic growth. The LPG here today is a great joy to my community. All the safety measures are met, which uh, the day they came from uh, the House of Reps, they see that it's 100% okay. And we community too, before we support this uh, project, we did our own, uh, our own fact findings, so we are happy. The safety is 100% sure.